I don't wanna be just friends. Baby, you my blessing. You should be my best friend. Hope you get the message. I would never stress you. I'll be your protection. Somehow I couldn't. Hey guys, and welcome back to my channel. Don't ask. Disclaimer, don't ask why the hoodie's on. You know if the hoodie is on, we're trying to hide something, okay? <laughs> but, anyway. but for today's video, I'm gonna be giving you guys five tips and tricks that you can use as a small YouTuber mid youtuber large youtuber i mean do you really need it as a large youtuber whatever level of youtube you're on i'm gonna help you guys with five tips that i think y'all should use and with youtube i honestly believe that you learn as you go like there's a lot of things i'm still learning and i've been on youtube for a few years now so i'm still learning there's a lot you gotta learn every single day it's like new tri tips and tricks you could use to make a huge difference so let's get right into this video. So the first tip will be cues and dramatic music. Do, 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 do. <laughs> the first tip will be to use a site named Rapid Tag. So the site Rapid Tag, what it does is it allows you to cue in your title of the video that you're planning on doing, and then it gives you ties based on popularity to insert in your tag section. Now, if you don't know where your tag section is, I'm gonna do another video, a part two to this video, explaining all the tools within YouTube. Like I'm saying, once again, these tools are outside of YouTube, not within YouTube. So yeah, I'll do another video showing you guys how to use the tools within YouTube. But that's the site you can use if you're not using it already. And honestly, it's very helpful because sometimes it's hard to sit down and be thinking like what tags to use to tag the video right there's only so much things you feel like you can say about a new hairstyle or a pixie cut or like when i did my haircut it's hard and you want to know which tags to use to get you more views and to get push your video out more right so that helps you eliminate all that by just typing in the title as you can see on the screen i'll put a little clip here as you can see on the screen just type in the title and then random tags will generate for you and you can just copy that and paste it in the tag section in your video which you're going to upload or a video that's already uploaded if you're doing this now the second tip will be a tip i literally just learned to buddy this website helps you with your titles of your videos so the first one was for tags the second one should be would be for titles so it helps you Title of the video helps you understand what titles are best for your video because it rates it on a it rates it based on the viewing of the video versus the amount of videos that's publicized on that using that specific title to allow you to see which titles are best for you to get more views based off of the market is way too competitive meaning it's too much people posting these videos your video may be way to the bottom and there's no one that's gonna search it right so that website helps you to narrow down and figure out what titles you should use it also suggests titles that you can use or better options so that you get pushed out more so i used it recently and honestly it's a big difference honestly so sometimes titles titles descriptions everything might be like so hit and miss and you don't want to, it to be hit and miss so this website eliminates all of that it's an extension that you actually can get on your google chrome browser it's an extension that you can add on it's an app as well if you're using your phone to edit and you can just download it and it's simple it's just a link to your youtube account but it's very simple but there's a section of it that you have to pay for so if you're willing to do that then you can the more details if you pay for it as any other website would you just get the promo is basically the basics so yeah if you want to help with your title that's a great one that you can use as well the third tip third, third, third tip the third tip would be to use audio library now this one is actually a channel that's on youtube sometimes it's hard to find like vlog music or music just to put in the background of your videos without getting copyrighted because trust me copyright oh my god it's a whole nine yards of drama but anyways that channel actually assists with that so you can go on the channel and sometimes they tell you to like copy the description of the song into your description box of your video most times i don't do it and it don't get copyrighted but 
that way you would have to just go to which beach you think is best like honestly i feel like i need to make my own beats like i keep on saying that because it's so hard and sometimes it takes so long to find the music and then when you find the music it doesn't sync so you're like oh my gosh you gotta find another song because you know there's types of music that syncs with whatever you're saying and it gives you the vibe when you're watching like rah, it's hard like the music i find in the songs is hard Back of it. the fourth tip for today the fourth tip for today would be thumbnails so normally when you're creating your thumbnails everyone tells you that thumbnail sells because everyone wants to click a video based on the thumbnails so if you're not a person that actually savvy with photoshop because i'm definitely not i keep on saying i'm gonna teach myself but just never get around to doing it but yeah if you're not photoshop savvy there's other apps that you actually can use that makes it easier canva being one and post my wall they are very easy to use simple they have templates you you can choose from your channel art template to a thumbnail template any channel banner anything you actually need but well, channel art channel banner same same yeah but anything you need you can use those apps for and it's free tell me now it's free it's free and so and they don't have the logo over because those logos are annoying so come on man what y'all doing y'all going on it yeah thank you thank you the last tip for you two would be the most cliche one which is be your fan for the fifth attempt because my phone keeps ringing I was in BSL. That comes with time because no one at first is comfortable. I mean, no one, absolutely no one is comfortable at first talking on the camera. Like, brah, talking to yourself. It's literally talking to yourself. <laughs> so no one is comfortable doing it at first. So with time, it grows. And just just be yourself. Don't feel like you have to put on a front or talk in a certain way or act away. Just be yourself, your natural self, crazy and all. Because somebody company is you okay boo <laughs> but anyways that's it for this video thank you guys for watching before someone else call me thank you guys for watching this video if you like it, give it a thumbs up if you're here for the first time tell me how you like this video down below in the comment section down below in the comment section <laughs> and I'll see you guys in the next video. Make sure you subscribe if you're new. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye. Road to 2K, baby. 2K on the way. Woo. Anytime they got some baby, you are the topic. More than a queen, baby, you are a goddess.